Good evening, I'm Charles Ladd, and this is news. Hundreds of Jamaicans were today turned away from hell because the devil says that he does not want them down there, as they were only coming to make trouble and mash up his place. The reports also said that some of them had gotten there by fraudulent means, like going in wrong names and traveling on other people's death certificates. The Jamaicans were also said to have been installing fans, fridges, air conditioners, and other cooling devices contrary to the laws of hell. However, it was later discovered that the man who sent them back was not in fact the devil, but another Jamaican who was trying to overthrow Satan. He is booked to appear before the Devil's Race Court next week, Tuesday. Continuing the news. A bus which crashed into a wall today died on its way to the hospital. Am I reading right? No, hold on. Look as if it is right. A bus which crashed into a wall today died on its way to the hospital, and the driver who sustained injuries was taken to a nearby garage to be out and duco. Reports are that the driver did not see the bus he was driving. On still on buses, come next year, it says here, the Minister of Transport has said that conductors will have to start riding bicycles to collect their fares so as to enable more passengers to hold on the buses. Meanwhile, still on transport, the Minister of Public Buses and Travelers Affairs has said that, contrary to what some people believe, but Air Jamaica will not be digested as he said that those planes are much too large for any one person to swallow. <laughs> one man was shot and killed by the police in the corporate area after he allegedly pulled his service finger at the police. One man was shot and killed by the police in the corporate area after he allegedly pulled his service finger at the police. Sitting can go, sir? No, but as a presenter, I'm not supposed to talk that color way. Same thing can go, so no, but that's not so much better either. Can sit and go? Okay, well, we'll leave that to continuing the news. It says here, reports are that the police were driving along Lie Way in Kilwan when they were fired upon by a man who pulled his service finger from his hand and said, Pow! and said pow the police returned the fire killing him on the spot an m3 inches service finger with three spent nails was taken from his hand the dead man was then taken to the morgue where he was treated and sent home he will later be charged with shooting with himself continuing the news Fire today did damage to a large section of a heap of garbage alongside the Riverton City Main Road and was put out only when there was no more left to be burnt. <laughs> damage is estimated at about 5.2 million cans, bottles, old papers and other debris and it is not known if the heaping was insured. <laughs> it was also believed to have been the work of arsonists and the firing squad police are investigating. Meanwhile, still on the firing squad, firemen attached to the firing squad are expected to go on a go slow today in protest against what they say is the shortage of persons to fire on. Finally, in the news, the Minister of State and the Minister of State for the State, Mr. Minister of State, has stated that he is not at liberty to state the state of the state and has taken off for some states in the state to report to the Secretary of State. That's the news to the moment. I'm Charles Ladd. Next news time, next news time. Please stand by for the sports and weather coming up shortly. <laughs>